ancient history meeting newest kinds of technology. In Israel, researchers have utilized the artificial intelligence to dig in medieval Jewish papers. Take a look. For more than a hundred years, scholars have poured over the Cairo Geniza, the biggest collection of medieval Jewish documents ever found. But even after decades of work, only a fraction of its 400,000 documents have been properly studied, many still lie in fragments. But now, researchers in Israel are turning to artificial intelligence to decipher what human eyes simply could not cover alone. A team working on the Midrash transcription project is training an AI model to read and transcribe these ancient scripts in Hebrew, Arabic, Aramic, and even Yiddish. The technology does what would take scholars years. Uh, that's our next step now to try to compare the transcriptions with known texts and uh, define which texts are close to ones we already know and others we didn't know before and that's the exciting stuff to discover the unknown. Uh, currently it's the unknown unknown, we don't know. It can cross-reference names, track words across thousands of documents and even match disordered fragments back into complete manuscripts. Researchers say the goal is to constantly improve the machine's ability to decode these handwritten texts, some of them a thousand years old. And when the AI struggles, human scholars step in, review the transcriptions and feed that learning back to the system. The project is funded by the European Research Council and builds on the National Library of Israel's digital database bringing together experts from universities across continents. Among the documents already transcribed, a remarkable 16th century Yiddish letter from a widow in Jerusalem to her son in Egypt. His reply written in the margins describing his struggle to survive a plague sweeping through Cairo. The Geniza itself, found in the Ben Ezra synagogue, was a sacred storehouse where Jewish communities deposited important but worn-out documents for eventual burial. Medieval Cairo, a city that outshone Damascus and Baghdad, a global hub of trade, science and learning, a thriving Jewish community that grew with refugees from Spain. Maimonides himself worshipped in the same synagogue some of his writings lie inside this collection. Now with AI, researchers say they may finally be able to map. Now with AI, researchers say they may finally be able to map what they call a medieval social network, tracing relationships, daily routines, and community connections across centuries.